Voodoo can help keeping assignments a little bit neater and more organized. Instead of sending emails, having students send emails with papers, Moodle allows you to create an assignment and for students to send you all their papers in that assignment. It helps to find the papers later and not having to look through your whole email list. It also helps to prevent students from saying the paper got misplaced and just from a paper really getting misplaced. Um, to create it, you add an assignment and you create it. In this case, we're going to focus on the grading part of them. Uh, open the assignment. You'll have the number of participants, how many have submitted it, when is due date, the time remember remaining. You can download all submissions if you want to. They'll download in a zip file. And then um, if you want to grade them, click View and Grade Submissions. That will take you to the gradebook for uh, that assignment. There you have all the participants who have submitted it, who hasn't. In this case, I graded already the two people that submitted it. Um, I fake graded them because this is just an exercise. And I sent them a file back. So how do you do that? Well, you'll notice here it tells you when they submitted the file, when the grade was given, and if you want to grade them or update the grade, click Update the Grade. In this case, otherwise you'll click Grade. You can download the file by clicking on it, or again, click Download All Submissions, assign a grade, type a comment, in this case, good, good job, Helen, then bring that file through the file man management system or dropping in a file from your desktop, and then, um, and that could have track changes, that could be just another file saying good job, or it can be any file that you want to send back to them. It could be just even an article you want them to read if you wanted to send them back an article apart from the comment. So what file you send them back is up to you. Um, it's nice though, however, to send a student a file with track changes so they can know what mistakes they made in the paper. Um, and then click Save and show next. And you can do that till you finish creating all the students for that assignment. And you can see this student didn't submit a paper but I can still go ahead and grade them and send them a file back, and save and go next, save and go next, and that way I can grade all the students for that assignment. The grades will be automatically then be added to the gradebook, which students can then access when they want to find out how well they did in the course. Uh, thanks.